Hey everybody, what's up today? How you doing? How's it going with you today? All right, we're gonna get into this video and uh, hey, talk about Aptera and this battery company that um, Sandy Monroe knows. So uh, let's get into this video. Welcome back to my channel. Oh, welcome back. Hey, listen, we're going to talk about this uh, car battery. I actually did a video on them before. Uh, Amperus, you probably know about them. Sandy Monroe knows about them, and he's actually been in their factory. And uh, he knows a good deal about the company as well as the president. And he's actually doing a podcast on them. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a link down if you want to see the whole podcast or interview that he, uh, uh, um, Sandy Monroe did with this guy. And you could get the full information that he brought out about his new battery. But um, let's go ahead and talk about the Amperes battery that they came out with. I'm here with um, uh, John Bornstein. And um, John is the CEO of Amperes. Now, you probably remember that uh, we had already talked to Ampris, and I was very impressed with their batteries, especially for aircraft. But uh, they've come out with something even better. And uh, John, I'm all ears. But the evolution is between, or what the evolutionary aspects of this cell versus the cell that we demoed to you when you visited, which was the um, high, the ultra uh, high uh, charge, the ultra fast charge or as it's called extreme fast charge, which is the six minutes to 80% state of charge. So this cell also demonstrates that, uh, but it goes even higher on the discharge and has higher energy density to boot. What does that mean? The cell that we demonstrated to you has about 360 watt hours per kilogram at C over five. That's the nominal specific yeah. energy. This cell has 400 watt hours per kilogram at C over five. Um, and so you can see that it's a non-trivial, it's a you know significant bump in the basic energy content, uh, that yeah. is energy per unit weight. And it also sustains very high C rates and the extreme fast charge. So. All right, so what Amperus is doing here is very impressive. They showed Sandy Monroe a battery that had 360 watt hours per kilogram. And they just came out with a new battery that has 400 watt hours per kilogram. So that, that's very impressive, considering most batteries for EVs today only have between 260 to 270 watt hours per kilogram. So what Ampris is doing is very, very good. And not only that, but you can charge them and they actually showed this. I, this is in my last video. I'll put the link down below. They actually showed it being charged up to 80% in just eight minutes. So very impressive what Ampris is doing. And oh man, I think that would be really, really great for what for Aptera. And we see that Sandy Monroe already has the inside scoop because he's actually talking right here to the, to the uh, um, I think he's the president, but we'll find out in the next part. And let's see what else, let, what else did they talk about? Let's get into that video as well. Well, the one thing that uh, I think I mentioned it before that I liked is that um, your batteries don't get hot um, as quickly as others. And to me, that's a big deal. I mean, really at the end of the day, I really don't want hot ever. Um, no matter whether it's an electric motor or a gasoline engine or, a, or a jet engine, there are certain temperatures I just don't want to see. And this seems to be doing a good job at keeping it down. And the other thing that I'm not a big fan of is sitting there waiting for my car to charge. Mm -hmm. Um, so most of the time I either do it at work or I do it at home when I'm sleeping. 
but yours will charge to 80% in six minutes. And to me, I'll take that all day long. I mean, by the time I parked and, um, you know, looked around, I'm, I'm probably pretty much ready to go again. I, I, that didn't even have time to get a coffee <laughs> at, uh, at, at the end of the day. That's, that's really quick. So maybe you can comment a little bit about that. Yeah. That's the same as the other one though, too, wasn't it? Wasn't yes. the original? Yeah. So, so that's right. So this is an evolutionary advancement in the cell that we uh, used as the vehicle for demonstrating the extreme fast charge which is, as you point out, uh, six minutes to eight percent state of charge. Uh, yeah. But what we've done with this is we've demonstrated a higher specific energy and uh, no compromise in discharge, in high discharge rate, high mm -hmm. C rate. So it's a, as I said, it's about, uh, you know, 360 to uh, was our previous specific energy. Now we're up to 400. Mm -hmm. So that's a significant increase. Uh, it's 10% approximately increase yeah, yeah. in overall uh, energy density, which is huge in this business. Um, so, yeah, I've, I've been with the company for 10 years um, and have uh, been a part of the sort of transformation from uh, can we do it to yes, we can do it and we can sell it. Um, and now what we're focused on is scaling. Uh, so we're scaling in two steps. One is our headquarters uh, here in Fremont, California, we're doubling our footprint uh, to get a fast jump on uh, a capacity expansion of about 10x into the uh, megawatt hour regime from hundreds of kilowatt hour, which we've been running for a few years now here. And then in parallel, uh, we're building out a facility in Brighton, Colorado, which will enable hundreds of megawatt hour uh, up to yeah. the gigawatt hour regime over the next several years. This is some pretty impressive stuff that they're doing. Um, when Sandy Monroe went to their facility, they were actually printing the batteries up or uh, making their batteries uh, to where they could recharge in eight minutes, but now you, they can recharge to 80% in six minutes. Wow, that, that is really impressive. And, and then again, um, what Sandy brought out is that they have eliminated their batteries from getting hot. So that eliminates the need for, you know, there being a cooling system running through the batteries to keep the temperature down. If they don't run hot, you don't need it. Of course, all you engineers out there, you probably know better. You. And if you do, just give me a comment down below. But I mean, what do you think about that? That's pretty awesome. And they also extended the range of the uh, kilowatt per gram by 10% from 360 kilograms to 400 hours per kilogram. So I think that's very impressive what they're doing. I think that's really good. And I'm so glad that Sandy Monroe know them. And I think that um, the only problem is they got to ramp their battery production up. Because right now, the batteries they're producing, I mean, it's kind of small. They're going to double that. But then, you know, he said that they're going to build a facility. You're just going to take a couple of years for that. Uh, but a lot of solid state batteries are going to be coming out right about then anyway. But we'll see. Let's see what happens. I still think that's very good for Amperus, uh, what they're doing. And it looks like Sandy Monroe has the inside scoop and he could probably get Aptera hooked up if they need to. But like, again, he's talking in a couple of years. So we'll just have to wait and see what happens. But uh, anyway, we'll just continue to focus on Aptera. All right. So now we're going to take a look at the accelerator program, see what's going on there. And we already know that they already opened everything back up. So this is very impressive. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my gosh. They have dropped so much. They have actually added 10 investors. Oh my goodness. This is incredible. And it's only been the first day since they opened it back up. Wow. That is incredible indeed. 
This is really going to drop very fast. I'm telling you, this is looking fantastic. And they are on the move again. Oh gosh, this is really going to drop fast. So with this being open, and I'm not a financial advisor, but you need to talk to your financial advisor. And this is the company you want to invest in, Aptera, with the uh, most aerodynamic solar-powered EV that's ever going to be produced on the road, at least uh, next year that we know of. And this is going to be a company that's on the rise. And so if you want to invest in them, once again, I'm not a financial advisor, but this would be the site that you come to and get it, get on board before they come out with their vehicle. Because once they do, this is going to drop dramatically. This is going to drop very fast. And if you want to just get you an app, Tara, hit my link below and it'll bring you to this site right here. So you hit my link, you come to this site, you get $30 off. You just have to put $70 down and it's all refundable and you can design the app Terra of your choice. And, you know, whether you want the, the 250 mile version or the 400 mile version, 600 mile version, then uh, this is where you would come to, uh, whether you want full solar package, whether you want all wheel drive, or whether you want to design your own interior. But right now, you can only get the LE edition. They're coming out with that first. But anyway, like I said, hit my link below and it'll bring you to this page. And then you can only have to put just $70 down and it's all refundable. But anyway, I'm going to give a shout out to my patrons. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for keeping me afloat. I really appreciate you guys. And if you're new here, I appreciate you too. I really love you checking out my channel. Just hit the like, ring the bell, and subscribe. And you'll catch all my videos when they come out. Or you can check out all my old videos that have already come out. But anyway, y'all take care. And I'll catch you on the next one. Y'all have a good one. Bye-bye. Pretend